In the vast cosmos, a mystery lurks that continues to challenge our understanding of the universe, the missing baryon problem. You see, baryons, which include particles like protons and neutrons, essentially make up all the visible matter in the universe, from the stars and galaxies to you and me. However, when cosmologists tally up all the baryonic matter that we can observe, they find a significant portion is inexplicably missing. This discrepancy between what we observe and what our models predict is what we call the missing baryon problem. It's like having a cosmic jigsaw puzzle with a vast number of pieces missing. This isn't just a minor hiccup in our calculations. It's a fundamental problem, a gap in our understanding of the cosmos that questions the validity of our current models of the universe. This mystery is more than just an academic curiosity. It's a fundamental challenge to our understanding of the universe. Before we delve into the missing baryon problem, it's important to understand what baryons are. Baryons are a group of subatomic particles that include protons and neutrons, the building blocks of atoms. These particles are essential constituents of matter in the universe, playing a significant role in shaping the cosmos as we know it. So, let's imagine the universe as a cosmic web, a vast network of galaxies, stars and other celestial bodies. This web is not woven with silk, but with baryonic matter. Protons and neutrons form atoms, atoms form molecules, and these molecules come together to form stars, planets, galaxies, and all other structures in the universe. But baryons are not just about building stuff, they also play a crucial role in the evolution of these cosmic structures. For instance, in galaxies, baryonic matter interacts with gravity to create the swirling spiral patterns we often see in telescope images. In stars, baryons are at the heart of nuclear fusion, the process that powers these celestial light bulbs and allows them to shine bright. The distribution of baryons in the universe is also key to understanding the large-scale structure of the cosmos. The way these particles clump together or spread out can provide us with valuable insights into the history and future of the universe. This is why cosmologists are so keen on finding out where all the baryons are. But here's where the plot thickens. When we look at the universe, we find that a large number of these baryons are missing. They're not where we expect them to be. This is known as the missing baryon problem, one of the biggest mysteries in cosmology. Understanding the nature and role of baryons is crucial to unraveling the mystery of where they might be hiding. After all, to find something, you first need to know what you're looking for. And in the case of baryons, we're looking for the missing pieces that complete our picture of the universe. Detecting and studying baryonic matter is no easy task. The universe is a vast expanse filled with countless mysteries and complexities. Among these is baryonic matter, the stuff that makes up the stars, the planets, and indeed us. But how do we go about finding something that is so far away, so dispersed and often so elusive? The answer lies in observational techniques. One such method is X-ray observations. You see, hot gas in the universe emits X-rays. By observing these X-rays, we can detect the presence of baryonic matter. This is particularly useful in studying galaxy clusters, which are the largest gravitationally bound structures in the universe and rich in baryonic matter. Another powerful tool in our arsenal is the study of the Cosmic Microwave Background, or CMB. The CMB is the afterglow of the Big Bang and carries with it a wealth of information about the early universe. By analyzing the tiny temperature fluctuations in the CMB, we can learn about the distribution of baryonic matter in the early universe and its evolution over time. However, these techniques come with their own set of challenges. X-ray observations, for instance, require highly sensitive instruments and can be hindered by intervening matter. Similarly, studying the CMB requires us to filter out a lot of noise from other sources. Despite these hurdles, the pursuit of understanding is relentless. Scientists are continuously innovating and refining these methods, pushing the boundaries of what we can detect and learn. For instance, newer techniques like gravitational lensing and the sunyev zeldovich effect are being used to probe the universe's baryonic content in novel ways. Despite the challenges, these techniques provide invaluable insights into the distribution of baryonic matter in the universe. Each observation, each data point, brings us one step closer to unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos, painting a more complete picture of our cosmic home. The cosmic web, a vast network of galaxies and dark matter, is expected to be a significant reservoir of baryonic matter. 
Picture an intricate interstellar spider web with interconnected strands of galaxies, gas and dark matter weaving together the universe. This cosmic web is where we believe most of the universe's baryons are hiding. To understand the distribution of baryons in the cosmic web, we rely on cosmological models. These models are essentially our best guesses based on the laws of physics about how matter in the universe should behave. They predict that baryons should be most dense in the regions where the strands of the cosmic web intersect, forming galaxy clusters. These clusters in turn are connected by filaments of galaxies and intergalactic gas, where baryons are also expected to be found. But here's the twist. While these models give us a general idea of where to look for baryons, they don't tell us exactly how many baryons we should find. For that, we turn to simulations and theoretical frameworks. These tools allow us to create a virtual universe, complete with its own cosmic web and baryonic matter. By comparing the results of these simulations with observations of the actual universe, we can refine our models and get a better understanding of the abundance and location of baryonic matter. Simulations have shown us that the cosmic web is a dynamic, ever-changing entity. Baryonic matter doesn't just sit still, it moves, it evolves, and it interacts with other forms of matter. This dynamic nature of the cosmic web adds another layer of complexity to the missing baryon problem. The cosmic web is a complex tapestry and untangling it is key to solving the missing baryon problem. By studying this vast network, we're not just tracking down the universe's missing matter, we're also learning about the fundamental processes that have shaped the universe into the complex and beautiful entity that it is today. So where are the missing baryons? Several theories attempt to answer this question. Let's dive into some of these intriguing hypotheses. The first theory is that the missing baryons might be hiding in plain sight, in vast reservoirs of hot, diffuse gas stretching between galaxies. This gas, called the Warm Hot Intergalactic Medium, or WIM, is believed to be a soup of ionized particles with temperatures reaching millions of degrees. It's so hot and scattered that it's extremely difficult to detect with conventional methods. However, recent advancements in X-ray and ultraviolet astronomy are providing new ways to probe this elusive medium. Another theory is that feedback mechanisms from galaxy formation might be responsible for the missing baryons. As galaxies form, they release immense amounts of energy in the form of stellar winds and supernova explosions. This energy can heat and eject baryonic matter from the galaxies, making it harder to detect. To investigate this, researchers are using hydrodynamic simulations of galaxy formation to trace the path of baryons through cosmic time. Finally, some scientists suggest that non-baryonic dark matter could play a role. Dark matter is a mysterious form of matter that doesn't interact with light, making it invisible to our scientific instruments. It's estimated to make up about 85% of the matter in the universe. Could some of our missing baryons be hiding in this dark sector? The jury is still out, but this theory continues to be an area of active research. These theories are just the tip of the iceberg. Many more exist, each with its own set of predictions and challenges. The missing baryon problem is a complex puzzle that touches on some of the most fundamental questions in cosmology. While none of these theories provide a definitive answer, each brings us a step closer to solving this cosmic mystery. As we continue to refine our observational techniques and theoretical models, we get closer and closer to uncovering the hidden baryons and unlocking the secrets they hold about our universe. The hunt for the missing baryons is far from over. As we navigate the cosmic web, each new theoretical advance brings us closer to solving this intriguing puzzle. These advances are not just confined to the realm of observational techniques, but also extend to intricate mathematical models and simulations. For instance, recent breakthroughs in computational astrophysics have allowed us to simulate the behavior of baryonic matter with unprecedented accuracy. These simulations are instrumental in predicting where the elusive baryons might be hiding and how they might interact with other cosmic entities. In addition, the development of new observational technologies holds immense promise. For instance, the next generation of X-ray observatories, such as the upcoming Lynx and Athena missions, are expected to have the sensitivity and resolution needed to detect the faint whispers of hot baryons in the cosmic web. Furthermore, the interdisciplinary nature of this research is leading to new insights. Collaborations between astrophysicists, cosmologists and researchers from other fields are yielding fresh perspectives and innovative solutions. 
For example, the application of machine learning techniques to astrophysical data is opening up new avenues for detecting and understanding the missing baryons. As we look to the future, it's clear that the quest for the missing baryons will continue to push the boundaries of our knowledge and technology. It's a journey of discovery that takes us to the very heart of the cosmos, unraveling the secrets of the universe one baryon at a time. So, what's next? Well, we're poised on the brink of a new era in baryon research, with planned missions set to probe the farthest reaches of the cosmos and groundbreaking theoretical advances on the horizon, the next chapter in the story of the missing baryons is just beginning to unfold. As we continue to peer into the cosmos, each new discovery brings us closer to understanding the true nature of our universe. The missing baryon problem is one of the most intriguing mysteries in cosmology. In our quest to understand the universe, we've discussed the role and significance of baryonic matter the cosmic web, and the methods employed to detect and study these fascinating elements. We've explored the theories and simulations that guide our understanding and predictions of the universe's baryonic distribution. We delved into the challenge of distinguishing between warm and hot baryons and their potential contribution to this cosmological enigma. We also ventured into the realm of galaxies and the intergalactic medium, where baryons play hide-and-seek, making their detection a thrilling yet daunting task. The various hypotheses and explanations for the missing baryons, including hidden reservoirs and feedback mechanisms, only add to the intrigue of this cosmic puzzle. As we continue our cosmic journey, we remain hopeful that the universe will reveal its secrets one baryon at a time.